Right at the top. And overall, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Simple, simple, but it's realistically. Now, I will say, you see the tip there? There's a little bit of worms in there. And now the canning company, they came and they had to spray my conventional because they don't want that tip. They don't want to waste that little bit. But they need to eat too. What's that? Worms need to eat too. Well, we need to eat. I don't want to eat what they're spraying. I don't care what you say on residual. Well, what do we do, Tony? Where's Tony? We cut that little bit off, right? That little bit does not matter, okay? But realistically, I made a mistake this year in this cornfield. I should have been planting a plant. And what did I say was a great plant over there? Buckwheat. Buckwheat, yes. Buckwheat interceded into this corn when it's really short, gives those worms something to eat instead of the corn. But the only reason why I did is because I have a different plan for, I want to put cereal rye out here right when this crop is off. Because right now it's pretty bare in there from cultivation, tillage, and like Mark said, that's pretty hard on it. So every time I do a negative, I got to make sure I do a positive. Just like everything in your life. You, you know, if you're doing a negative, make sure you do a positive. If I eat that big pizza, I got to <laughs> go do something positive. No. Yeah, but hopefully. yeah, take a look. Uh, any other questions? Let me have a bite of that. Eat it. It's... <laughs> Tell you what, we, had, we did a come pick your own sweet corn here a couple years back and little kids came out and they didn't realize that you could eat that. You know, that, that's got to come from Walmart for food. And by the time those kids left, every single one of them had a big <laughs> ring and it was like a candy store. And it is, it, it tastes just sweet as can be out here. So go ahead and grab. I don't mind if you throw it on the ground because guess where that, where's that going to go? right back into the soil to feed my biology I have on every acre of land there's about an elephant size of microbes well in my farm in most farms it's more like the size of a little pig because they've destroyed the microbes and guess what we need microbes for what our gut health so starts here goes there all right that's the big thing go ahead and take a look take a bite now that you know how to peel it Bev Take, take it home. You're more than welcome to grab some, stick them in your pockets, make your husband carry them. Now, where are those hemp plants? They, they were, they were back. The same deal? Ah, no, 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 no. Does not pertain to hemp. Oh, man. Buckwheat and rye don't play together well. Uh, they do, but I, because my goal is to do no-till organic soybeans next year, so I want to have that the dominant plant more times than not though i like diversity i i usually plant like six seven things in there uh my goal though is i'm thinking a year or two ahead a chess move like we talked about on the you know chess or checkers yeah yeah so they got to have a plan and that's my plan what's that when you say no till does that mean no disking no tillage at all no yeah and so actually with the rye you can actually come in when it's tall when it's headed out you can roll it over and crimp it and it kills it. So now you're doing, you got the weed protection from the residue without using a chemical or tillage. And it's not always easy. Uh, Ruth, where's Ruth? Oh, Ruth is over there. Her husband, John, last year they no-tilled soybeans and crimped the rice, organic. And he absolutely loved it because his summer was free. Yeah. Yep, no trips across the field until harvest. And now this year, the rye, we had, had a problem with the rye, and how many times he's been in the tractor? Oh, man, at least six or eight, because the army worms ate the rye last fall. It yes. Late to replant. Yep, yep. So that meant tillage and yep. weeds and, yeah. So it's not always easy, but it is doable. And I know he's like, I got to get that rye because I don't want to sit on that tractor all summer long. My husband is eating corn right here at the Good job, Dean. Good side. job. Farm All right. Farm.